Good morning, beautiful Capricorns. Welcome back to the channel. For all of you that are new, I'm Frankie and I welcome you to the channel. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. It really helps the channel to grow as well as it helps me to pick up on your energies. So what I'm doing today is I'm asking for a sneak peek into April for your zodiac sign Capricorns. Let's see what the universe can tell us about what's uh, in the month of April spirit for Capricorn. What will happen in April? What should they be aware of? Loyalty. Capricorn. What can Capricorn expect to see in the month of April? Uh, yeah. A tornado? Chaos? Oh, that's past energy. You've gone through a chaotic period. Um, the belonging card is here. Letting, that spirit telling you, uh, yeah, this nine card with the chaos, you're on a new beginning. You've left like a tornado zone. Um, and spirit is telling you with this belonging card that you do belong. The universe has called upon you. And indeed, you do belong. Oh, maybe some lust or both. Uh, making sure you don't believe in people that make oaths to you, but you might be making an oath to yourself. Let's see. Yeah, it's about obedience. And t not believing people who are making false promises, making oaths to you, and then they turn a blind eye to the oath that they made to you. But what, yeah. And this is a reminder, don't forget. Spirit is saying, don't forget about making promises uh, to people that had empty promises. Uh, they're full of chaos and be obedient. Uh, Be obedient to spirit, to self, and to not forget this chaotic period that you've been through and believing in people that make false promises and oaths to you that they have no intention of keeping. Let's see. Yeah. And being your individual self. Uh, a reminder to keep your individuality, not to lose yourself. We had those messages yesterday for Capricorn, and this is a reminder to remain an individual. Sometimes when we get a, attached to chaotic people that we end up in the storm, in the whirlwind with them, and we forget where we belong, and we forget our identities, and we forget who we once were. And this is spirit telling you to remember to be your individual unique self. Um, stand up for your own individuality. So what messages would you, what's coming in for the beautiful Capricorns in the month of April? What things can Capricorn look forward to spirit? Is there exciting news, events? Well, some of you are working on something and some of you may be forming teamwork and partnerships with somebody, alliances. This is also work. So, yeah, leaving, look at this person is like looking at this storm going, no thanks, not for me. <laughs> and uh, some of you are receiving new love. And justice. 
things being balanced back out in your life. Yeah, there was some type of ending, but someone wants now, after this ending, to offer Capricorns their love. Or at least some type, a lot of Capricorns will be receiving a love offer. Yes. You may have, for some of you, have your choice in love. A lot of love cards here. Yeah, after walking away um, from a situation, someone is uh, keeping their eye on Capricorn. I got this same card in the Sagittarius reading. So I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of Capricorns have Sagittarian placements in their natal chart. And if you don't know your natal chart, you can get it for free on Cafe Astrology and click on natal charts. All you need to know is your birth date, your place of birth. And if you, it's helpful if you know your time of birth. If you don't, that's okay too. But someone's watching... Wow. So the message I got for Sag was that, yeah, they're watching to see some type of communication. They're sad. They're watching to see, and they're messaging you because now they're sad. Someone is sad. And feeling lonely. because they see your self-worth. They see how this is Capricornian energy. This is someone who knows their self-worth. This is someone who knows their value and is working on their pentacles and is financially stable and grounded. This could be fear, but someone, this is something you don't see. What's happening in April? Happiness, joy, what is ever hidden side by side, the moon and the sun together. Uh, what was ever hidden in the dark has come to light and Capricorns are working on their happiness now. They're following their higher intuition. This is also saying, and I can't help but say it. This is, beside this, this is the mistress card as well. So if there was a, a mistress being hidden, it has come to light. Yeah. And... This wanted to come sideways, so I'm taking it sideways, which means that it's to do with healing, moving on, and someone taking a leap of faith. So for this individual, they're being exposed. Capricorn is sitting over here knowing their self-worth healing from a broken heart trying to move forward trying to take the leap of faith not quite there yet but getting there and this person has been exposed in the month of april about what they were hiding nine of cups in reverse <laughs> finds out they were not all, a bag of chips and all that this is nine of cups in reverse it's where they were is not wish fulfillment and for Capricorn 
this is not wish fulfillment. Whatever you're finding out, there is exposure being done for things that were kept hidden. Magician being here, someone's trying to manifest making an offer to work on things. Or Capricorn is just busy working on things and uh, manifesting. It's slow coming, but they're manifesting. And they're receiving some type of recognition, reward, or attention. And they're healing. Capricorn energy from toxicity and from controlling individuals taking control back of their own life and moving forward. Going out having fun in the month of April. Yeah. Working on their own stability. Male and female energy here. This doesn't matter. This is someone who knows their worth. People see Capricorn as stable, grounded, self-sufficient, independent, the catch. After being wounded, you're going out, you're having fun, you're taking control back of your own life, your own destiny, you are having fun times again. And now this person may be wounded. Because you get balance. You're getting your energy back. You're getting, your emotions are getting balance. You're getting grounded again. You're getting your emotions in check again. Mm. After this rejection, you get a new blessing, a new opportunity. And this person now sees you as a missed opportunity. Look at this. They were handed something. They turned it down. But there's a new blessing coming in. That's a missed opportunity for whoever you were dealing with. But this is a new opportunity to work on something. And it could be a new job coming in for Capricorns or something you're working on. Uh, the King of Pentacles the king of cups is here this is someone who with a lot of emotions but they don't express them and now there might be some competition look at this guys there is the king and the queen of cups with the five of wands in the center of this this is fighting arguing battling but it also is competition for this happy family. Someone wants to come rushing in now. They see how grounded and happy you are. And now they want to come rushing in. And for some Capricorns, it's if you're in a, a marriage, uh, someone is angry and you're fighting and arguing and just know that this is about a family unit. Someone looking at all the time and energy they invested. And for this person, this is reaping what they sown. Yep. Someone's finding you very beautiful, very attractive. Um outgoing, friendly, energetic, a lot of psychic intuition abilities. But you may have blocked this individual or your heart chakra is blocked. But you'll be celebrating something. Uh, you will be celebrating something in the month of April that makes you very happy even if you're feeling lonely
and a lot of you are receiving some type of truth and clarity as to why you were blocked, ghosted, uh, why there was a third party. Things are getting revealed. Things are getting exposed. Choices. And a lot of Capricorns are going to have their choices in love. And somebody is very honest here. What's happening in the month of April for Capricorn? What can they expect? Well, you can expect that the Wheel of Fortune is in your favor. You can expect to be received. You may have your options in lovers. You can expect to see the Ten of Pentacles, long something long term, long term happiness, and someone uh, taking uh, action on you. Wow! Look at this Wheel of Fortune with Ten of Pentacles and taking action. You receive some type of friendly message. There was a betrayal here. Maybe that's the message you're going to hear, that this person was betrayed. <laughs> I don't know, but... <laughs> you're receiving some type of blessing coming in. The Wheel of Fortune and a lot of pentacles. This situation of betrayal has come to closure. You receive closure, and your ships are now coming in after all of this stress, anxiety. Your ships are finally coming in. You are finally closing out this cycle. Yeah, a lot of you are going to have to make a decision. Weighing things out. Will I, won't I, should I, shouldn't I? Because a lot of you are getting several options in love. And opportunities. It. Some of you are getting new jobs. Some of you are, yeah, you're transforming. This is the death card. You're transforming. This cycle has died. You receive closure. You're starting a new cycle. Wondering which way to go. Transforming. It's transformation. After being so heavily burdened, things are transforming. That cycle has come to a close. And now the Wheel of Fortune is in your favor. And a lot of you are getting new options in love. Yeah, this stuck energy. And the you receive some type of offer. You may have been in hangman mode or feeling stuck somehow, but this is stuck energy completely. The past energy kept you so stuck. This new cycle, yeah, you've got the Empress here. You're, you've got an offer coming in, and you're creating something. A lot of you are seen as the Empress, male or female energy, but you're creating something as well. You're nurturing something, and there's a lot of growth and development in the month of April. may come as a shock to you. The Wheel of Fortune is in your favor. Equal uh, reciprocity. After, we know that in the past there was breadcrumbing going on, but it may, yeah, may come to a shock to you that this person who was giving to do got cut out of the picture. There's too many court cards here.
Ace of Wands, passionate, new beginning. Gathering back your strength and courage. You're single, abundant, and you're seen as the catch. You're being strategic. I know this person was deceptive, but we know that Capricorns are being strategic at this time. And whatever you're strategizing, whatever your plan is, you're making some type of plan. Now that some of you are getting new jobs, some of you are being, um, the wheel of fortune is in your favor. There's so much going on for Capricorns. It's to do with pentacles. You're getting some type of, uh, so, some situations that it's long-term success, long-term stability. Wheel of Fortune in your favor after this terrible cycle that you've been through. And you're using your strategy to obtain this, but this person who is deceptive is going to hit their own tower. Um, they may have been out giving to two in that situation using the wand and they may have been cut off but uh for capricorns you're getting your strength your courage back you're abundant you've got a passionate new beginning um with the equal reciprocity and it may come as a shock to this is not a bad shock this is a good shock and this empress whatever she's working on producing some good fruits uh, male or female energy there's long-term stability coming in the month of april a lot of you are going to have your choices in lovers and um, are have your options of who you want to choose and uh, a lot of you are getting passion a lot of you are getting new jobs something that financially makes you stable uh, other people who are self-employed working on on their own uh, businesses are gonna have a success what's wow yeah new beginning clarity it's everything has been crystal clear now you have a clear understanding of this past you're getting a clear understanding of your future and let's see what else is coming in what can information can i get for Capricorn of what they can see in the month of April spirit. Capricorn. Whatever was hidden has come to light. Things have been exposed, revealed. If they haven't, they're going to be. And you move on. You're gathering your strength and courage. You're abundant. Whatever you do, it's abundance. New beginnings, absolutely. You're on a brand new cycle. That was a very brutal one you've been through. Yeah, and you've got family, friends, and guides all around you. New partnerships, new alliances. Everything is new. You've got your Ascendant Masters here guiding you. Whoa. Peace. You're going to have peace. Finally. Meeting new friends. New supportive connections. Kindred partnerships. A lot of these, you're finding new love. Taking... That's what I said about the strategy card. You're planning and taking action. There's planning and action. Huh. Being guided by your higher self. Your higher self knows. Listening to your higher self. What can Capricorn expect to see in the month of April, Spirit?
travel for a lot of Capricorns. New beginnings, family, friends, and guides. Your Ascendant Masters are protecting you, guiding you. You get peace, new, needing new supportive connections, uh, kindred partnerships for those of you seeking love. There's planning, there's action, you're listening to your higher self, and there's travel involved for some people. True love. <laughs> Capricorns, you honestly deserve this. And uh, the sacred temple. This is spirit. Uh, this is learning to value your own body, mind, and soul. You find true love. A lot of you will be traveling listening to your higher self, planning in action, that strategy. There is kindred partnerships coming in, new supportive connections, peace. Your ascendant masters are, are with you, backing you. You have uh, family, friends, and guides around you because you're on a new beginning, a new cycle, finally, for the month of April Capricorn, it's looking really favorable for you, and you deserve it, Capricorn. I love you.